what's your biggest fear about 2020 and what's your biggest hope to coming out of it biggest fear and biggest hope my biggest fear is uh second uh, term what second term yeah <laughs> that, they, <laughs> that that might literally be my biggest fear um because i don't i just i have no hope for the <laughs> um I've, I've joked with my mom about moving out of country if that happens uh again <laughs> Um, I don't blame you, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh, (laughs) My biggest hope, I guess, is that um, the U.S. actually learns from its people, I guess, Mm -hmm. um, and that the quality of life kind of gets fixed at least a little bit. um, Because even just a small improvement can be nice. Uh, Yeah. I I think we're seeing, like, steps towards that. It's not at the speed we want. You know, yeah. like they did do the like, you know, take out a certain, uh, cer- I don't know if ever how many billion dollars from the p- police in LA to put it into the communities, which is a good start. I know it's we're still recommending like more. Much yeah. of it. But just like for me, I, because I, I love history, like I, I, I'm hopeful that things turn out okay. Because one, if humans were really assholes and shit, we would have killed each other and nuked each other already. And there would be all out, it would be the Wild West. But it got, it, it went from like, you know, the Wild West to some sort of modern society where these certain to certain lines you don't cross. You know, it's not perfect, but history shows that we get out of it. So, like, even though we're kind of going through a repeat of of the civil rights movement, we also went through two world wars. <laughs> yeah, we kind of repeated itself. So, but almost yeah. there three, almost three. <laughs> Beginning of the year, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> Everybody forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The fuck. It was like one event after the other. It's just that's what I find. It's find I'm finding interesting because it's like so stacked. And then, um, I I've been I considered this year in 2000 in the beginning of the year like this is going to be the year to amplify. You know, amplify the company and all that stuff. But in in reality, like there's a saying that goes when man plans, God laughs. So, cause it's like, you know, cause everyone's plans. I remember in 2019, everyone's going to be like, Oh yeah, 2020 going to be lit. Fucking Halloween is on a Saturday. Uh, Everything was on a Saturday. (laughs) Everything was perfect. Like it was like the stars aligned, but the stars aligned for something else. So anything, it was a disruption. And they, they call it, people were saying 2020 vision and all that. Mm-hmm. I think it was more like, not so much like their vision for the future, but to give us vision to the ugliness that needs to be fixed first mm-hmm. before, so we can move forward. Because otherwise, it's, it's almost like, I, could, I always say this, like an abusive relationship in a sense that like people are experiencing. It's like they, they, it, they can only take so much on term, and some peop, uh, before the people lash out and fire back. I feel like a lot of people are doing that and 